Sorry for the long uh, time delay before I got this thing posted, but this is my black 72 Cuda. It was a 344-speed AC car. This is the one I put the engine into, the one I had running on the engine stand with the hot wire harness. So far, I've got 20,000 miles on it. Runs very well, runs like a new car. AC is cold. Had to put a new uh, copper core evaporator in it. And an eBay condenser. I put in a 12 inch pusher fan just for the AC condenser. Along with my 16 inch uh, puller fan that comes on with my Hayden fan controller. And these two relays are big 70 amp relays and two 60 amp fuses just for the fans because the fans draw a lot of current and the wires get hot even though they're small wires they get hot because they're pulling a lot of current and i had one of the fuse holders uh kind of melt down with the old style fuse so that's why i put these big 60 amp fuse holders in with this 10 number 10 wire okay so uh this is my 72 hemi cuda it's in the Mopar Action Magazine of April, if you happen to see that issue. And this is it. So I've got PT Cruiser convertible seats in here. Uh, they both have armrests. They both uh, tilt forward so you can get to the back seat. I've got the 833 overdrive transmission in here, four speed. I've got that little lever you see hanging off is my line lock, because I use it a lot on hills and you know, it's a line lock, you use it for burnouts too. I have a jeg speedometer in it. Shift light set at 6200. AC control panel, factory AC. There's my computer down there. Very easy to access and swap out or take with me. Had the windows all tinted, tinted dark. It's a black car and it gets very hot in the sun. It's 95 degrees today in St. Louis. And this AC keeps me nice and cold inside. Cold where my skin is cold and that's the way I like it. So, uh, Building a 6.1 now. 6.1 I bought cheap and it's gonna either go in the 71 convertible or my 70 RT, which is a 440, but that runs so well now. It's all electronic fuel injection with a multi-port, easy EFI on it. So we'll see. Um, haven't decided which one it's gonna go in yet, but this being a convertible, it's hot. So I've got to update its AC also with a different evaporator. But that's it. Let's see what happens with uh, the next video. Thanks, guys.